Hey there, this is Game Whore Game. I am Poob. And today, we're going to have some fun with, uh, not, well, Carmageddon, but we're playing in the Carmageddon section of it, because I've modded my, uh, I've modded my game. Just, just one moment, let me get a little bit of music playing here. I, I, uh, I can't really do the Fear Factory music because, uh, I don't want to get copyright strikes, but I did find some, uh, royalty free industrial music that we can play while we're while we're messing around here. Anyway, so why am I on car mod getting? Because I went and got some new cars. I, I installed some new cars. And I figure we'll take out some of the uh, some of the better ones. I'm not gonna show you that first one there. I'm gonna keep that for, for a future video. So yeah here's some new cars. We got uh, Blood Riviera, the heavy impaler, the hick pickup, the lead pumper, uh, Monty Carnage Paralyzer, the Trashum, the Stodge Barger, the Stodge Squad Car, the Moth Truck. We're gonna take that one out. I think this might be the one we take out today. Um, the V8 Rattler, very nice model there. Uh, the V8C Manta. Um, the v <laughs> the v okay, and V8C. I think these are the Vigilante 8 vehicles. Uh, you probably recognize them if you're into that game, but uh, I never really played a lot of Vigilante 8. But these vehicles are actually still really cool in 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 game. This I've used the bus. We're gonna we're gonna take it out for a rip in a future video. Okay, so what else we got? Okay, and then I think what's left is just all the uh, all the regular vehicles, which you know I got mod. Oh right, and since we're in um, Car Mod Geddon. We, I, the APC you can usually get, the uh, CUNT you can't normally get. Uh, I might take this out in a in a future video just to see if we can kill absolutely anything at all. Look at the picture of that cop. Oh, uh, that's great. Okay, suppressor. We're gonna take this out in a future video as well and just wreck the hell out of some things. Okay, now quick quickly skip by that. You might pause and catch what the name of that is, but uh, we're, we'll look at that at a different time anyway. Okay, so. I haven't taken out yet, but I assume it's going to be overpowered as all hell. <laughs> Look at the driver, it's like, uh, his jean vest and dynamite, that's perfect. Alright, um, is this a, is this on a Vigilante 8? Um, because I don't know, if you know, let, go ahead and, uh, you know, shoot me a message, let me know that. Anyway, let's customize this guy, let's see what we got here, what do we got for skins? Uh, that one's just like a washed out version of the first skin. It is too, it's just a worn out version of the same truck. Alright. <laughs> Cack and Ballers Transport. Awesome. Uh, wow, there's a decent amount of uh, skins there. That's pretty good, I like this. A lot of these mod cars do have a decent amount of skins. Okay, Road Warrior Trucking. Oh yeah, we're going with Road Warrior Trucking. I love, uh, I love uh, Mad Max, so I like the idea of that. Oh yeah, just like the regular big rig wheels, or like, you know, your standard big rig wheels that you might see in real life. Yes, that looks good. Alright, um, I don't think I have any parts to add onto it. Oh no, I do. Okay, so, since this thing is probably tough as nails, um, what we're gonna do is just put the biggest engine in it, and some <laughs> rusty edges for a uh, little bit of extra offense. There we go, I got my paint job. Oh wait, did I get in? Yeah, I gotta get in the car. I forget to do that sometimes. Okay, so we're gonna play Car Crusher just because I, I wanna like keep the destruction just rolling, right? So, um, let's see here. Yes, Car Crusher, we're gonna play uh, each vehicle for about 10 minutes just to have a good look at the model and uh, and things like that. Um, also, if, uh, oh yeah, we'll just take a random place. I like that, I like the idea of that. If, uh, if you're interested in uh, getting some of these mods for yourself, um, I will actually put the the mod, uh, the location to get these cars and uh, the mod installer for them in the description below. So uh, as well as like the information about who made them, I feel kind of bad because I can't bring it up right off the top of my head. Anyway, without further ado, let's take this truck out and see if we can't fuck these people up. All right, I don't know how long this is gonna take to load. Uh, I'm just gonna put it on pause until it uh, until it does load up, just so you don't have to watch this. All right. All right, here we go. Let's see how the moth truck does against the uh, the opponents. Okay, we got the bodywork vacuum. Where are we at here? Hopefully my game sounds are loud enough. They're actually really quiet to me, but I think they're coming through uh, relatively loud on the recording. So hopefully you can hear everything just fine. Oh my God, that bomb did an incredible amount of damage. 
All right. Hey, Russ. Russ, come here. I want to talk to you. It's my handbrake button. Is that my handbrake button? B. B is the handbrake button. I was just playing Just Cause, and I think uh, X is the handbrake button on it, and not B. Uh, okay, here we go. Let's get some hits in. How, how heavy does this thing hit? I'm rolling too much coal. I can't see what's happening. All right. Also, um, some news about Carmageddon. Um, the, it's coming to consoles. Oh, yeah. Let's just take this guy out again. Oh, man. This thing wrecks the hell out of people. Yeah, um, so, uh, yeah, Carmageddon is coming to consoles as uh, its title will be Carmageddon Max Damage. And uh, basically it's this, but some more cars and different types of vehicles. One thing is 18-wheelers with trailers. It looks like it's going to be fucking glorious. So not to mention it's going to be bringing the game to console, which is good. I mean, why why shouldn't console players have a shot at this game? Um, hopefully it'll do better than, like, the console version in the past. Oh my god, that was great. Alright, let's go to the replay mode. Yeah, hopefully it'll be a little bit better than uh, some of the console versions that came out of like earlier Carmageddon titles, because they were they were a little less than good on console, I found. Um, I, I, did, I did play one of them briefly back in the day. Okay, well, that wasn't that great a kill. Let's move on. Yeah, so, yeah, max damage. It's going to be like 18 wheelers. It kind of looks like they're going to do some, uh, some uh, Mad Max style things with it. Oh, yes! Get pinned, motherfucker! Oh, man! The Volkswagen is so tough. He actually died when he hit the ground. Hell yes. I gotta get out of this fucking alleyway. Alright. Let's get out of here. No, oh, no. Let's just drive into the wall, I guess. This model is really nice. So you can see the engine with the, uh, the, the fan going. I hit X to, uh, use my handbrake instead of B. I wonder, I should probably change that control just so it's, uh, the same between Just Cause and this. Okay, this thing doesn't handle as well as the bus. When I had the bus out, I was having a good time. I'm, I'm having a pretty good time with this, mind you. Look, this guy has no chance against this thing. This thing is so much larger than any other opponent. It's great. I know this is not difficult for me, but that's not the point. The point is just to, just to show off some of these, uh, some of these modded cars. Oh, yes! We're just going to show off some of these modded cars and have a romp around with them. I mean, obviously this one is quite powerful, but, and um, I've got two or three different ones that I know are going to be quite powerful that I just want to go out and, and have a play with. Uh, as you'll notice, I have, the, I have the blood on green too. It's just uh, a little bit more peaceful that way. Oh man, uh, I only have one anvil. I'm, I'm used to it still being uh, three anvils. They, they uh, changed the the power-ups a while back so that uh, you didn't get three anvils since it was like absolutely ridiculously powerful. Oh yeah, we got this guy pinned on our front end. Ah, uh, he's gonna get away though. He's gonna get away. We gotta get some good hits here. Alright, man, this truck is just massive. Alright. Oh, come on! Yeah, that's right. That was a pretty good hit. Didn't do a whole lot of damage. I think our front wheels are in bad shape. Okay, we're starting to fall apart here. Yeah, look at that engine. That's really cool. The engine and the exhaust and everything all vibrate when you hit the gas, so looks really nice. Oh man, come on, get turned around. I don't have my front wheels. I don't like to repair constantly like uh, like some players online do, because I it's the, the part of the joy of this game is just the damage modeling, and I don't want it to be uh, I don't want it to be so easy that you know I just constantly have a perfect vehicle. That's not what this is about. Wow, was that already 10 minutes? I, that felt really fast. All right, everyone's eradicated. Let's have a look at some of these wrecks. Okay, Madame Scarlet. I was going to say Madame Spaghetti for a second. I, I know that's completely wrong, though. Oh, I hit continue. I wanted to look at the wrecks, but I hit the wrong button. Oh, okay. So, uh, that was a quick look at the uh, modded car. What is it called? The V8 Moth Truck. Um... Next time, I think we're going to take out the bus from Vigilante 8. We're going to have a, a romp around on that. We'll, we'll use a different map and uh, so on and so forth. And we'll just have some fun just uh, driving around and smashing some shit, basically. I'll talk about a little bit of Carmageddon as we go along. And, yeah, that's going to do it for now. So, this is Game More Game. I'm Pooh. Have a good one.